what's going on good people hope you guys are doing well uh i said i was gonna come back probably around time for the all-star but uh we're close to it we got about another week of plans see if we can try to get some games in before then um let's see here I'm going to show you our standings now. We're at 72 and 14. We have been playing very, very well. I'm actually very surprised that we're that high. I wasn't even paying attention to the record at times. But, uh, yeah, we've been doing pretty good. And as you can see, the rest of our division is kind of, you know, the Phillies being uh, here really shocks me because I they picked up, um, uh, what is his name, uh, uh, Judge, Aaron Judge. And I'm kind of like, what the hell? They got Aaron Judge, Bryce Harper, and uh, Kyle Schwarber, and I'm, and, but they're 39 and 47. They just got through making the World Series in real life, though. Uh, but it's really crazy to see that. And um, you know, we've been doing excellent. Uh, show you my stats. Yeah, this is where my overall is right now. It's an 89, still using that, um, I think it was the dart. But I'm at 86 games, 351 at bats, 60 runs, 449 hits, 25 doubles, 4 triples, 44 home runs. Let me tell you something. I have zero idea how I switched from using a tool shed to the dart, and I hit more home runs because of that. Whereas my power and everything with the two shed was like in the 90s. But now as you, my power is like maybe after the gear I put on, maybe about the 60s, close to the 70s. It just doesn't make sense. I, I, I don't understand it. But 110 RBIs. And this is before the All-Star break. So we're doing really good. It's a crazy, it's crazy numbers, of course. Uh, I don't walk a lot. Uh, I try to make sure I get the hit. Don't strike out a lot either. Uh, we're at 12 stolen bases. I'm actually surprised by that. So, and we're at a, we're at 425 average. OPS is ridiculous. The slugging is ridiculous. And, uh, yeah, we're doing pretty good. And I'll show you some of my quirks here. Hidden machine, 2020 vision, quick reflexes. I didn't even know about the sniper. That's new. Had an extremely accurate throwing arm. That is very new. Even, uh, wow, okay. That works. Oh, hell. All right, um, Luke Voigt is still trash. Uh, he's been trash most of the year, except for every now and then when he does hit the ball, he hits a home run. So he has 15 home runs. Uh, Lane Thomas has been doing good. Abrams is the person that shocked me with how good he's been hitting. Like, consecutively lately, he's been, he's been really hot. And he's up in the 300s now. They, at one point, his average was like 230-something. So, yeah, that just shows you how on fire he is. Garcia has disappointed me. He was an all-star last year. Don't think he's going to be one this year. And 261 average. Ruiz also surprised me with how he started off hot, and now he just absolutely sucks. Um, Vargas is still being Vargas. It's just that he's not hitting home runs. Yeah, last year, I think he had like 20-something, huh? Yeah, he had 21 home runs, but he's only got five so far this year. It's pretty crazy. Uh, Hassel's a rookie. He started off really great, but then he completely fell off. I mean, he was hitting like 280 at one point. Anthony Alford, I don't even know why they picked this dude up um, in the offseason. He is like just garbage. I Him and uh, Luke Voigt have just been like whatever. And Robles is starting to pick up his play. And so... Which is really good to see. Lucius Fox is trash, but he also doesn't play a whole lot. He's more of a backup utility type guy. Yeah, and they made a they made a trade to get uh, this Velade guy. I don't even know where the hell he came from. Uh, in his games he's played, he's hit really good, but it's only been six games, and you know you know how it is. The sample size is really small. Uh, yeah, yeah. Other than that. Good to go. Uh, I'm trying to think. Oh, yeah, lead, league leaders. Just to show you how good I'm doing, um, Ian Happ is hitting 336. It's still crazy. 
that he he's hitting that well. Not that he's not a good hitter, but just it's crazy. But we're above him. We're way ahead in hits right now. I didn't think uh, Iglesias passed me, and uh, we never get a day off. So, <laughs> Let's see top uh, top five in doubles. Yeah, we're probably tied. Yeah, tied for what that is eighth with triples which is really shocking most of them i got because of blunders in the outfield but a couple of them i just ran them out the only person that's close to us in home runs is solaire the 24 that's how many home runs we're hitting ramirez in the al is at 31 but that's still crazy where we're at and 110 rbi no uh, nor now is the closest everybody it's it's a lot bro like Ramirez got 74, but it's a lot, and we're just, we're killing it right now. So, you know, we're leading in, uh, not, uh, MVP voting, of course, and all-star voting. We're right on track. That's where we want to be, and it's only going to go up from here. All right, that's enough of that. Let's get right into it. We're starting a series against the Pirates. I guess we can do that and wear that ugly ass cap. It's really crazy on here. <laughs> uh, some of these teams that are like really bad, like the Pirates, they play you hard on Hello, and they will fans, mess around and, and beat you. And you be like, what? Baseball coming at you. It's the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Washington Nationals. <laughs> All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Okay, what the hell? Why would they have a red hat? Just about I understand Washington, go, but on the mound in that's this weird. One, Joe Ross. And Singy, we were talking earlier about how he's doing a great job navigating through tough spots. Oh, I didn't even get to show so you the pitching. With when it seems like there's more pressure, he's more calm and settles in. He's done an incredible job with runners in scoring position. Most guys... <laughs> and they already got three. <laughs> oh, my God. Baseball, but for some reason... He gets loose this team is trash. Like they're absolutely trash. Off the hook of you know tough situations and get his team back in the dugout. Number forty-five Ooh, hell down the pitch. box comes up empty. I guess their head is there. Re uh, red. Keller. I have zero he's idea. He's really known as the starting pitcher that's going to get you deep into the start. It's not that he's not capable. He just hasn't proven that he can do it yet. That just throws off the entire color of their uniform. One one now. That oh one missed. He's got such great stuff. You just don't know from start to start whether it's a potential no hitter or it's a guy that's only going to give you three or four innings. That's really bad. <laughs> All right. It's a one one. Good eye right there. But for the most part, with that kind of stuff, you expect him to get to the middle of the ball game. I haven't seen him talk this extensively about a pitcher between uh, uh, the at bat. A none in this game. And a pitch. Out and there's some guys center. that deserve it way more than Keller. Ranging into the alley. He makes the grab. Runner tags up for third. And he moves up 90 feet. Right, Runners move the him up. That'll work. One away. What does he need to do in order to get deeper into the game? Well, I'd say it's they're still talking the about it. Pitches because when you're talking I've never seen that, though. I've, I've never the seen them dive game. extensively. They say stuff about some people, but in between the entire at bat. In the air, right get down, side. get down, get down, get down, get down. Nah, that foul, is a foul ball. Ultimately, we were the June player the of the swing month. And chase a pitch that teases the zone and ends outside the zone, but so far he hasn't been able to do that consistently. And here it comes. And there's something you don't see very much in today's game: the pitch out. So we've been the player of the month in every month. April, May, and now June. It's pretty fantastic. Keller with a move to first. Robles dives back in. It's all about that contact and vision, though. The home run to come. The 1-1. One, one. Okay, is he going to try to steal now? If he was going to steal, he should have been done it. Yeah, that's outside. Chris he is with so worried about that dude. And the speedy guy at first, 
He's in a favorable hitter's count. Well, if nothing else, I mean, this is a great spot for a hitter to be in. I was going to swing, but I wanted to see if it would fall out the zone. Ah, shit. It was going outside, too. Damn. And the inning is over. He got me on that one. It was going outside, too. I should have just let it go. No errors and a man left. We head on now to... We head to the bottom of the fifth. And now the first baseman, number 45. The first baseman, number 45. Come on. Keller, back to work. High Got that one. Out of uh, I went straight field. up. Yeah. Makes the grab one down. Well, that's going to fall on the team on this one. I would get an over. In my first, first okay, team did some seven five. For Washington, number forty-five. I will get an over every time I start recording. I get an over. <laughs> I don't know what Base it is. Throws over. Robles dives back in. Batting real good, but as soon as I turn that thing on and say record, it'd be like, nah, you can't even hit player. Another move to first, and yeah, they're keeping him close. Robles runs. Oh. And first offering is fouled off. I thought I was going to get it before it fell out. Uh, messed up his run. My bad, dude. I see it driving. Let's go. Pickoff throw, and he's back standing. I sometimes try to hit it Robles. if I feel like they're going to, it looks like they're going to get thrown out. out, too. Comes up empty on the nice swing. Nice slider. Two now. Two really good back-to-back -back sliders. Now in an 0-2 count. He's feeling real confident about finishing this hitter off. He can go anywhere he wants. Good slider. The pitch. In the dirt. Now one and two. He throwing some junk right now. And the right hander deals. And delivers outside. Throw over to first, and he's back in standing. Come on, come on. The pitch. Rudder goes again. Swing damn, he got me on it. Throw to second. Yeah, he stole it. Jump. That damn slider, man. He got a nasty one. Tommy Mace. Number 45. That's a hell of a pitch. The that damn thing he's looks like it's coming straight in, especially. and it... When guys are completely falls right at the right as soon as get to you to deliver power chopped out in front God of the damn and yo credit to that out. dude man that that slider is nasty Shit. <laughs> we won but he, a damn over of course to your right as a player and you say you know what we're good uh, we may have had some tough times earlier on but this is a good team and you start to expect this kind of play out of yourselves we'll see if this translates into right, moving on to the next one than it is right now man that, that's a nasty slide i hope they don't put that dude in that, that damn thing is is crazy and welcome into the ballpark happy to have you with us major league baseball on tap it's the pittsburgh pirates and the washington nationals all right, we got to have a better game this game. Kate Cavalli been killing it, man. This rookie film. Coming your way next. Ready to go. Starting Eight on the mound in this old. one, Kate Cavalli. What do we have on him? Well, coming into this game, hitters are batting under 250 against this starting pitcher. So he has 17 starts, man. How effective he's been. He's been able to move his pitches around, add and subtract, change up the looks. Yeah, dude is on. Dude is on one. Comfortable and start squaring up the base. He's been playing really good. This one. Up now for Washington, number 45. Obviously, a guy who makes good contact. Hey, you dropped my average out of the 420s. I don't like that. In today's game, the value. And the fact that he hits both righties and lefties. Oh, I should have swung at that. That was bad. I'm too anxious for a hit. Let me chill out. <laughs> Next pitch is outside. And that is ball one. 
Come on. I don't know what it is. It's like, I feel like I'm swinging like a heavy ass bat or something. This is crazy. Got a good eye there. Ooh. I was going to swing, but I was like, uh, the leg is kind of going low. They're definitely looking to do some more damage. Swing and bless one down the line. It's got him. It's fair. Oh, the last minute. Hit pretty hard and sure had home run distance. If you're the pitcher out there on the mound, you execute it. Just a long strike. You go after him and finish him off. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Ah, man. I thought I had that one. Oh, good pitch. What a way. Well, he should get some fist bumps when he gets back in the dugout because even Good pitch, he man. Guy, he got me on that one. Damn. Good ass Next pitch. Next is the speedy first baseman, number 45. Number 45. First offering misses badly for ball one. Maybe that was a great pitch. I'm sorry. That was a good one. Next pitch, not even close. Move to first. Back in there standing. Who's this? You see? You say? Is that how you say, man? Kikuchi? That was a hell of a pitch. Turned on, but Come on, man. Damn, everything third. is foul, man. Come on. Abrams on at first. Nobody out. Hey, one time. Right now. Here we go. There we go. Line and a base hit into right. Find the ball. Find the ball. Keep going. Why did he keep going? Lead runner to second, oh, so two on, and nobody out. speed is a 91. He's been really well lately. I'll tell you, man, it's such a good feeling when you smoke a line drive. Oh, God. Oh, like boy. Here you go. Are, king, are you going to actually get over the Mendoza line? You feel like a true professional hitter more than a bolt the other way. Roll the short. And no. Ball. He is safe. And what, he made it? The throw by a whisker. Just Whoa! Out, he man. said, he "Fuck you, guy." Yes, I am gonna get over that Mendoza right line. Really protected with two strikes. I right can't there. believe he made the he run. Close, but man, he got the barrel to it somehow. Look nice at him jump! Bad ball hitting. Now the base wow, is he barely made it, it, but he made it. Got damn base hit. All right, Lou. Base is loaded. Come on, Garcia, bring us all home. Trying to drive the ball to the opposite field gap in these situations. If he takes that, gotta give Lucas props. He only got a 50 speed. This game wide open. On the ground, the third might oh. be two. That's a double play. To second, and a run scores on the double play. Ah, Garcia, you it's gotta, you gotta wake run, up, man. Too good to be hitting the way you are. Double play is kind of a rally killer. And now Anthony Alford. Taken high in the draft, he's had that top prospect label over him since he put on a professional uniform. But at some point, that starts to go away, and you've got to produce at the big league. Level. And of course, and like all season, he and strikes out. Hitting number four. Next to him for the trash, Nats, man. Number forty-five. All right, looking better. And first offering is found. And boy, you're gonna get messed up with that cutter. Come across that middle like that. Yeah. So they get a man aboard. A little high, but I saw it and wanted to, wanted to try to get it. Game for him. He's been really hot lately. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters they take so many reps in the cages, working on going to the opposite Come on, field, Luke. and it doesn't always translate into the game. But right there, it did. And he did it perfectly. And now they've got some speed on first. So we'll see. Oh, he slashed it. Ah, uh, it was going to be a, yeah, it was going to be double play anyway. Toss the second, and it's yeah. a double play to end the inning. I was trying to steal because he has like a little hitch in his uh, pitch, but he, he hit that slide step. So digging in, number 45. Chris, baseball today, so many strikeouts, and they are available to pitchers. But this is a guy that puts the bat on the ball and is kind of different from the players that we see day in, day out. Yeah, his swing is so good. I like they might have chased him, yeah. Time. He gets the barrel to it a lot, and that produces more base hits. Next nope. offering upstairs. Come on, Crow. 
Will Crowe's play with the net. Nobody on. There we and go. Into right center field. Come on, it's the base, it's and that's going to roll to the wall. Yeah, I was going to try for it's a triple, a but. Third hit of the night. Eh. Throw that ball nicely. Get that speed up to about the 80s. Maybe we'll do that. Off his back. Kind of put it all together there, and he's rewarded. Much the better game than the first game. Boom. So two down. Luke Voigt will step to the plate. Luke Voigt two for three in this game? Shit. Okay. Next pitch is popped oh, that one's up. out of there. You're going, you're going, you're going, you're going. Hayes makes the catch, and that'll do it. We look ahead to inning number eight. It's the next. All right. Back here at the ballpark, all set for the start of the inning. Here's Chavis now. Michael Chavis. Michael Chavis. 2-2 two -two now. On the ground, right side. I don't know why they keep make him like whenever you press the button, they make him run away from the pitcher. So I guess the animation can feel better about the distance it's going. It's really weird. Alright. Yeah. So we're on a seven game winning streak right now. There's been some luck and there's been some really good play. I think you get to this point, you start to look at can we double that? Make it double digits. Make it two touchdowns. Finnegan make been it killing it this year, man. And yeah, yeah, 42 four saves. For Chris Cavalli, nine and oh. I need to save. I hadn't saved in quite a bit. Let me um. Yeah, Cavalli been killing it. I'll show you the pitching. Like we, that's what's really been getting everything for us. We don't have a bunch of great hitters. It's the people doing their jobs and they play good defense. But the pitching has just been. Great. Even um, what's his name? Uh, crap, I can't think of the dude's name now. Josiah Gray has turned his season around. Cause at first he he was pretty bad. Uh, so yeah, look at Mackenzie Gore, thirteen and three, just killing it. Yeah, I think he only has yeah he had three a three eighteen ERA. Ross has uh been doing great, nine and two, three fifty three ERA. That, that's a little higher than he was uh, last night. Oh, he's on a cold streak. That's why. Cavalli has just been killing it. I'm very surprised his, his ERA is not lower because he's just been striking out everything. Steven Strasburg is, was do, doing absolutely amazing, but of course, hurt again on the IL. Yeah, Josiah Gray is on a hot streak, so he his ERA was like in the sixes at one point, and he got down to the threes. Patrick Corbin uh, was pitching um long relief and was doing great and you as you can see he's like only he's six and one but as soon as Strasburg got hurt he got he had to become a starter and when he became a starter he started being ass again and he's uh 632 era it's ridiculous but he's six and one as soon as he became a starter he just he just been he been on one bro let me see how much how long Strasburg. Strasburg hurt his wrist. It was only out 10, 10, 10 days or something like that. Then he hurt it again. The same wrist. And now he's out for two, three, uh, three, three to four weeks. Just fucking ridiculous, man. And I, he needs to just call it or something. I don't know. I, even in real life, it's it's been such a struggle. Did I already save? I don't remember if I did. Oh well, and then now we're doing it again. All right, let's continue on. Finally, they put uh, Abrams in uh, Garcia's spot. Man, Garcia's just not been hitting though. Here in Washington D.C., glad you're with us. And Chris, of course, you have to think about that 2019. World Series run really impressive by the Nats. We've got a Thursday matinee on the show. It's the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Washington Nationals. Alongside Chris Singleton, I'm John Shelby. All right. And oh, my, here's the first base. My bad. I should let them talk about Gore. This guy He's actually is been doing an really good. level hitter, especially considering contact, just the ability to hit for average. What you really like, though, Stays in against those righties, and that's not so I easy as a right-handed batter. 
Vargas at second. Glad I held up. On at first with nobody out. Damn. Tap softly third base side, a swinging bunt. One well, at least we moved everybody up. Move somebody to third, I'll take it. First and second, no outs. At the plate for Pittsburgh, Tuka Pita Marcano. Tuka Pita Marcano. That damn game can say Tuka Pita Marcano, but it cannot say Joey Meneses. That is fantastic. Good feed, that's one. On the first double play. Tuka Pita Marcano, Joey Meneses. <laughs> he can't do it. On the feed, the second right there. You gotta love that glove toss, Boog. You know, sometimes people Ooh, think these I guys see you, are being CJ Abrams. flashy, but it actually can make more. And now the first baseman, number forty-five. Number forty-five. Contreras picks over, and he dives back in safely. Are you gonna steal, or what you gonna do? That's Abrams. Uh... First off, I don't want to swing if you're going to try to steal, but if you're going to steal, you need to go ahead now. Wait for your pitch up there, huh? And the pitch. On the ground to the left. Off balance feed. There's one. What a double yeah. play that, that was. was. Good. Inning over. Three innings complete. It's the Nationals one. And the good play. double play. And welcome back. Top of the sixth inning. Now batting Key Brian Hayes. Key Brian. To the right side. Didn't think I was going to make that, honestly. First for the out. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's... Back in Washington, D.C. Bottom of the inning. And now up for Washington, number 45. Come on. The wide to kick the pitch. Ooh. Swing and a miss. Just a bit and late on that. Front that I mean, well, a bit early, I'm sorry. That's hard hit in the line. Damn it. Reynolds makes the play, and there's one away. Now the man, Can't get a home run, run, man. Come on. And now here is Give me a home run. run from a video, at least. The tying run at the plate. Swing and a bouncer to second Abrams. Over to first. That's two. Nicely done. One, six, three. Should have turned the camera so you can see it at least. <laughs> Midway in inning number seven. I'll and be thinking about it. Stretch. All right. Number 45. Holding strong at two. For the Nationals. It's interesting. He plays kind of a, a power spot defensively, but runs pretty well. So when you're looking at that position, you're not expecting someone that has maybe above average speed, but he does. Damn, we are killing left-handed pitching. Shit, I didn't know I was over 500. <laughs> and I think that skill set really upgrades the position because when you have that kind of speed, it makes the whole team that much better. I should let that fall too. Get your pitch on. Let's see, he's trying and to walk me. One on the way. That's a strike. Uh, what about okay. playing another position on defense okay. that would require a little more range? Absolutely, and I think if push came to shove where they had to make a, a oh, move during a game. God, he got me on that. People, you might even be able to put him in center field. On to first. I can't believe that uh, shit, yeah. man. <laughs> well, when you reel off eight wins in a row, you're this close to double All right, we got three. Oh, oh my God, man. I am just now. fucking up. It's hard because you 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 want to try to do good on your video, and you know you want to kind of like like if I'm away from the video, I'm killing it. <laughs> I'm like, damn, I'm hitting all these home runs and this this and that. Then I record, and it's like ass. <laughs> and you want to give? I want to try to give the good content that you see all the stuff, and it's like, bro, nah, bro. All right, we're going to have to see if we can do better in this uh, Philly series. Um, what am I going to do? Yeah, let's get our skilling up. Oh, okay, we got a, a few people. Uh, Garcia's on a hot streak, really? Okay, I guess. 
And welcome in I don't really know why this team is doing bad. Brings you a matchup of division rivals. It's the Philadelphia Phillies and the Washington Nationals. John Chomby, Chris Singleton with you. And singing a guy who could change this game with one swing of the bat. Number 45. He, of course, leads yeah, You just say his name. Runs. You know, you said yeah, Tuka Peter Marchano. At the plate, and it seems like every time he connects, the ball is traveling out of the ballpark. So when you have such a threat like that, Man, we are. other guys in the lineup oh, should God. be This is a, a coming ale. Just to let you know there. right now. Next is the speed. They already went in 2 1. I'm not shocked if this one's an L. It's Patrick Corbin. When he's starting, is usually a walk in L. Up the middle. And there you it go. Finds its way I just can't get I can't get any lift on the ball. I don't know. First and second now with nobody out. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. Just kept it simple. Played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from. And there's just no one there to knock it down. Here's Luke Voigt. Drove in two of their three runs do, in yesterday's Luke? game. And he deals. And he walked him. Okay. Well, that sets up a Bases really loaded. That's game. what we need. These are the moments when everyone in the stadium gets really locked in. Really? He's Luis second Garcia. in second base all-star vote? Game yesterday, so well, he, he does have 16 home runs. Point. I didn't pay a teacher head. Yeah. Left I keep on forgetting. It's really not about average. On the ground to first. Could be two. Fires to second for one. They get the out, but the run scores on the twin killer. Yeah, he does have two... Uh, 12 home runs. I mean, 16 home runs. So that that works. Double plays, kind of a rally killer. That could make him an all-star. Hebert Ruiz, a switch hitter, batting right. That's right. He did win the Gold Glove Award. Very highly regarded defensively. Fun to watch him control stuff behind the plate. Good game caller. Good at framing, but it's that big arm that really stands out. Squeezes it, and that'll do it. Yeah, he just ain't been a good hitter. Second inning coming up from our next. Yeah, but them dudes camp. got like Aaron Judge and Bryce Harper. You, you think they be winning every game by like 30 or something? Uh, yeah, we gonna contact swing it. Well, you know what? Let's power swing it. Let's see. If, let's see if we can get some off our power. Let's see if we can. I always do contact. And that one hammered. Oh shit! Think I might have got it. See yep. Damn. <laughs> wow. I've never connected off the power swing. Number 45 on the year, and they add to their lead. It's six two. Damn. I tried to power swing and actually got it. Usually I end up like hitting it and it uh doesn't go anywhere or roll down the sideline or it's double play. Guess we timed it good. All right. He got that up and out of here. Welcome back, Gene Segura at the plate here. All right, that was fantastic for the video. Something good, Jesus. And a ground ball to first. Got him on the off balance throw. One up, one down. Corbin holding his own right now. Let me not speak too soon. Got that hitter to roll over. So yeah, oh shit, he let as <laughs> soon as I said that he let one more run in. Alright, can we get a no? Let's see if we can. That boy gonna get uh caught. He gonna get better watch out for that pitch out. Hassel can it, he he ends up getting caught stealing more often than not, and that's it's really crazy to see it. The pitch. Ground ball to the right side. All and right. That one finds its way through. Much the better. And the throws off. The oh, line he kept going. Third. Just a simple ground ball the other way. That he's had so eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel. Put the ball in play and just hope it finds a hole. I did not think he was going to run the third. First, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Oh, he wanted to steal. And Luke Voigt climbs in. We'll see how this works out. Hey, keep it going. Stay hot, huh? Runner he's takes going, off. Going. There's a ball. No. Nope. second, he's safe. Really we're too high. Hey, yeah, we actually stole it. All right. Earlier, now he swipes second, showing off the speed. Really fun to watch him play the game. All right. There we go. Number nine. That's thumbnail. Third, number 45 over at second with one down. 
swing and a miss. Damn it. And he's down on strikes and two away now. Well, he didn't get the call on the mound the pitch before. No felt like he should have had him looking, I think. But come on, Garcia, bring us home. Right Don't strike out. To get him to Don't strike out. Two outs. And down and on strikes out. he goes. <laughs> Third out, and that ends the frame. We played four. You think with 16 it's home runs, he had way more than 36 uh, RBIs. That's so first insane. First and second with one man gone. And here's the first baseman. Ooh, shit. Number they put it on him. Damn, no nine, three. What, you're playing this kind of rival. Take your game to another level. All right, three for three. Let's see what you got. Well struck right field. Come on, That's get bad. out. They're getting out. And it oh, he hit the, the wall. Fence. No, what are you turning it back for? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? The run comes in. I have no idea what made him turn it back. I just took my finger off the button. So close to blasting that one out of here the other way. It was close. It was. It's very tough to do when you take on the outfield gap like that. Beautiful swing, though. Let the ball get a little deep and drove it to the opposite field. That should have that. All those dudes should have at least got home off of that, though. It did bounce off the wall. Second and third, one gone. Luke Void at the plate. He's 0 for 1. Come on, Luke. Kicks and deals. And there's ball four. Okay, well, you take a walk. You get a walk, and you get a walk. Everyone gets a walk, boo. <laughs> now at the plate, Luis Garcia. A strikeout and a walk. Come on, Garcia. What you got? The easiest thing when you're talking about a guy that's, you know, Perhaps Come on, Luis. Be in the rotation, you know, maybe a long relief guy to not start an inning, ah, to come sure. into an inning with pressure on it and, and try to get you yourself fly. comfortable. Here's the catcher to hit. Hebert Ruiz, Ruiz man. Come on. You need this, three. man. You need this, bro. Come on. Number nine. Put a grand third. slam Number on him. 45 it. on second. Number 34 on at first with two down. That is ball four. And wow. Home a run. He's really gotten himself well, into a mess out there and now forces home a run. With all the right. Well, this you want to walk people. Getting away from him. Base is full, two gone. Here's Lane Thomas. <laughs> right hander kicks deals. Hit weakly on the ground. They get the force. That ends the inning. All right. Well, 11 3 will take it. Ready to go for the last half of the game. Yeah, I thought now it was late in the game. That was early in the game. Cool. Back to work. Swing and a miss. Damn. And that's strike one. I thought it was slide right there. He threw it extremely ball. well. You talk about just a ton of breaks. So tough to get that barrel to. Great pitch, man. This first two pitches is just great. And the pitch stays alive. Try to sneak that slider in on the corner. Oh, shit. Get down. Yes. Look at that. Little blue. I end up hitting the camera. Sorry about that. Well, he wasn't afraid to hit with two strikes. Little blue. We'll take it. Maybe spread out, but he got the job done right there. Is that a four for four? Luke Voigt to stand in. I think that could be. Pick off Luke the first, and he just got his nah, hand in bro. there. Ain't happening. Number forty-five. I would try to see over here. We win eleven three. Damn, he got that. To deep left field. Back there. That's it. See you <laughs> You heard that sound. He Luke got that. Look at Luke. And they throw a pair on the board. It's Holy shit. Green. Luke waking up. Luke waking up. Man, I've been talking nothing but shit about Luke all year on every video. Because he's a cleanup hitter, man. He killing it today, though. Look at that. God damn. Get away with making a mistake like that. And right that there, boy got that one. Back here in Nationals Park. 
And Mark Bike, he might be getting hot around the right time. He might be. The two on. On the ground right side. And that one handled. He might be getting ready for a good second half. Well, certainly doing his very best out there on the mound to bring that win streak to a halt. 15-3. Hit. We both them boy there. No one wants to be the guy that causes the team to lose. In fact, Man, who did the penalty? Let, I just got to see this. I want to see How can I help who did all this today? damage today. This is a great feeling. It's uh, like why at five? Oh, I was five for five. Wow, I was five for five. All about the team I don't think I ever had a five for five. Our final score for Chris Singleton and our entire crew. So, Luke hit a Luke home run. Everybody got uh, mostly RBIs. Hits. Damn, everybody just kind of did their part today. Okay. Patrick Corbin went eight innings. Only gave up five hits. Damn, everybody I'm talking bad is uh is showing me what's up today. <laughs> everybody I talk bad about. All right. Less than two miles south of the United States Capitol, welcome to Nationals Park. The show has an NL East matchup. It's the Philadelphia Phillies and the Washington Nationals. First pitch coming your way next. And that man looked mad as hell. Like, God damn it. First pitch moments away. All right, Josiah. Hill, Josiah Gray. And Chris, he's a guy that gets better when things get tough. Yeah, his batting average against is actually better. His strikeout gym, to his so walk is ridiculous. We'll to dance his way Look at that. I think he has the most strikeouts on the team. And now the first baseman, number 45. 425 is about what I've been averaging. I would like have an 0 for 2 or something and then. Out towards right center oh shit, field. might have swung a little too fast. Oh, to that's gap. landing. And it one hops the wall. I'm actually gonna go for it. Throw cut off to third. There's the tag. Ah, he yeah. got me. And that's the inning. I had to try it. No score. I had to try it. Ah, it was close. Number 45, digging in for the Nationals. Oh, they got four. They just yeah, they say revenge game. Contact. One of the best in the game at putting bat on ball. He's got such quick hands, and he's gaining pitch recognition. That keeps him square to the plate. There's a good chance that his bat stays in the zone a long time, and that produces solid contact consistently. Next one misses. Ball one. Well, on. Certainly doing his very best out there on the mound to bring that win streak to a halt. Oh, they got Luis Severino. Next pitch Didn't know misses. that. Two and one. Looks like he's being a little. It's crazy the talent this team so has, but they're like last in the division. It's crazy. Doesn't want to make another mistake. Oh, right side, yeah, I swung Segura. at that. I thought I swung at that late. It said it was good. First, I thought I swung at it late. Do it for Washington. Brandon Marsh steps to the plate. Oh God, it's looking like an over. Can't do right. Can't get right. Left hand batter waits. Grounded to third. Could be two. The throw to second. How about that double play? Yeah, but y'all got to put some runs on the board, bro. Number 45, digging in for the Nationals. We got to do something now. And first offering is fouled off. Now, this guy's definitely looking for a big swing of the bat right here. Try to close that gap. But, you know, at the very least, if you could find a way to manufacture that run from first, it feels like it's really important to getting back into this ballgame. And the next pitch is way outside. Hey, need you right here. Need you. Come on. In the air, right field. Yeah, that's going to fall. Settles yep. underneath it. That's how it be. Damn baseball, man. I just went five for five, and it's like, no, nah, bro, this algorithm, you do for an over, bro. Ooh, okay. Base is loaded. All right, let's see if we can hunt for a good one here. It's like everyone else is in slow motion, and he's in full speed. And that's I should have swung at that. Some guys are just more confident if they can track that first pitch out of the hand of the pitcher. I should have swung at that. And 
And now the lefty. Sosa. They take the force out. Damn, I should have swung at that first one. It dropped right in there. It was a slider, but Sometimes road trips can be tough. You're away from your family, yep, they but when you can hit, win, stop our street. Silence that opposing crowd. It makes things just a little bit better. It makes the road trip just. Oh, Josiah did not Six have a good one. Look at him. Didn't have a, a good Chris one. Gave him seven hits. But look at his strikeout. Nine of them. We'll that dude is ridiculous. He got all the skill in the world, but can't uh. Can't stop anybody from getting hit sometimes. That dude is uh it's ridiculous. He'll strike you out though. Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. Today in the finale of this three-game weekend set, it's the Philadelphia Phillies and the Washington Nationals. First pitch coming at you right after the break. Yeah, I don't know who this guy is. He's a lot of dude. All right. Two outs, nobody on. Number 45, digging in for the Nationals. The first base hit, number 45. Nice warm day here, good baseball weather. Does that change anything, Chris, especially for the hitters? Absolutely. You feel so much more comfortable at the plate. You're not worried about... You know, getting jammed Damn. on fastballs inside part of the plate. Oh, they uh, fell. Kind of be more selective instead of just looking out well, of the way so that you can get the barrel to it. He must have ran really damn slow. As well. Hitting is really so easy for some better. guys. One thing that I can see already, his bat stays in the zone on plane. I don't know. It's like he was jogging on that play. Like he should have definitely had that. They have a high contact rate and they have more barrels because of that bat being on plane. And even when you don't get it great, it's still hit hard enough to dunk something in like that in front of the center fielder. He trying real hard that move. At the belt and fire. Here's the pitch. Run around the goal. Gets it to first. Inning over. One left for Washington. And the batter now is Reese Hoskins. Right. Hitless of the first two games of the series. He's 0 for 8. The 2 Ground ball. Could double be play. Two. Beats the second out there. On the first double play. All and that's right. the inning. This is Bryson Stott. Had the day off yesterday. Batting now. The second baseman. Bryson. Slow roll into first. And he handles it himself for the out. Now here is number 45. He's kind of an outlier, especially when guys are consciously sacrificing contact to deliver power. <laughs> uh, let's go. His swing is so good. It's in the zone a long time. He gets the barrel to it a lot, and that produces go more base Let's go for a contact swing, though. Could try to hit home run, but... And fouled off. Come on, man. That should have been a hit, bro. One down, base is empty. Out to short. Hey, I shouldn't reach for that one, damn slider. On the run, sends it over to first. And there's two away. Good late bite on that slider. Okay. Got the hitter out. Definitely had a good late on, uh, bite on second, it. Two down. And now it's Alec Bohm. Now the, third base Alec. the pitch. Oh. On the ground. He takes it himself what the hell? the bag, and that'll do it. Last Did you see that animation? What the, the hell was that, bro? Number 45. <laughs> now. Chris, baseball today, so oh, many we got a chance to get to go ahead and run. Available to pitchers. But this is a guy that yeah, I'm going to try to contact swing it. I don't want to put it in the air. The players that we see you just never know. Day out. Line drive. To his hand. God damn play, it. And that's out number three. And now here is Harper. Good contact guy, good now defender. Right fielder, Bryce. Bryce 0 for 3. I just want to be, I'm just curious. I want to see where his, uh, his stats are at this year. On this, well, on the game. What is he batting? 252? 19 home runs? Hmm, interesting. Bunting, and it's in the air. Oop. Harper retired. 
and that's Go sit down, Harbor. Stretch time. It's the Next to hit for the Nats, number 45. A lot of people hate that dude because he left the Nats, and I'm not. I was upset that he went to a rival. I, I was like, damn, man, I had to go to Philly. I did hate that, but I didn't like hate him. I hated what he said about Nats fans. Like that pissed me off because I was like, dude, no, everybody really did back you and uh, stuff like that. That's what really made me mad more than anything. Oh, he gonna walk me? That makes sense. Yeah, but other than that, I ain't had no real problem with him because, I mean, we won a championship right after he left, so it was like, what's there to be mad about? We actually won a chip, you know, but I didn't hate the dude or nothing like that. Here's the DH for Washington, Luke Voigt. The one-two. Swing and a miss, and that is that. Eighth inning coming up. It's the Nationals three and the Phillies two. All right. Well, these guys just want to keep it rolling right now. You win this series, you got another team coming in, and you want to do exactly the same. Maybe even push a little further, get yourself a sweep. You know the fans are going to be behind this club. They've been playing really well, and these guys, you can tell All they right. the energy. Is that the end of the series? Huh. All right. Okay, let me see. Oh, that was the end of the first series with the Phillies. So we got the Marlins and the, Phil the Phillies next. So next time we come back, I will be at the home run derby. I'm just going to go. I'm just going to play everything else off screen. Just wanted to show you guys a little bit of where we're at. And, you know, team's doing pretty good. And, you know, catch up with everybody on that. <laughs> hope you guys dig in the series though uh i'm gonna i plan on doing the, um an nhl one i just gotta get my rosters and stuff together and uh, i'm just trying to i gotta get this one done and I, i'm working on 2k right now um but yeah everything's still good with it but i appreciate everybody checking out the vid hope you guys come back for some more i did not know that that's how joe ross's hair looked under that damn hat <laughs> like that's a lot of hair bro <laughs> all right all right if you're new to the channel guys like and subscribe and uh come back and i'll see you guys in the next one peace